Hello and welcome back to my Unturned Arena Let's Play series. In today's episode, we are going to be playing on this hill right here, Unturned Italia OP Arena 3. And I really like this arena because they have a bunch of cool kits pre-made for you that I really like. It's not a creative arena, but it's very OP when it comes to the kits. You get full gear, full armor, full gear, everything. Um, so if I just do slash kits, all those kits right there, the blue ones, if you can see them, um, there isn't really a good background for this, but <laughs> um, but all those, those are free for you to choose. So if I want, for example, um, let's say I want the fighter one, I just do slash kit, fighter, and I receive the kit fighter. Fully equipped with armor, health packs, grenades, and all that good stuff. So this is one of the reasons that I really like this um, this server. So let me just rearrange my stuff here and wait for the um, for the game to end. We are playing on the Washington Arena map. So yeah, also sometimes you get uh, like attachments and stuff as well in your kit. Anyways, I'll be right back once the game starts. Stay tuned. Also, one thing I would want to say real quick is that if you do if you do slash max skills, then all my skills have been upgraded to the maximum level. So that is pretty cool as well. Um, yeah, I'm still waiting. All right, so the match ended. Apparently, we have a team of two people here, but um. Yeah, also I want to say that third person is enabled on this server. Okay, looks like it's only three people. And if they are still in a team, it's those two against me. Oh dear. Wait, some someone joined the game. Good, I'm not alone. Well, technically it's just more people to um, fight. But anyways, we are spawned in. You can still, even though there are kids, find like equipments, healing stuff and stuff like that. Um, so I will be looking for that because you can't really have too many bandages and s stuff like that. So let's see if any people are in Seattle here. Um, have to move around quickly. I see a dressing. Yeah. Pick that up. And oh, another one. And I don't really want a scope on this thing. Um, I'm trying to learn how to use third person a bit more. Um, ooh, I love that dot side. If you hear banging in the background, I'm sorry, but can't really do anything about it at the moment. <laughs> uh, let's see here, anything useful? We have a adrenaline. I don't really need that, my skills are maxed out. Let's see, where is the circle closing in on? Olympia military base just behind. Okay, that's not too bad. We should probably head over there right away. I do see a gun. I will drop that in fact and pick this over here and equip this here just because. Um, eight times scope, why not? The maple strike might be able to be used as a um, as a makeshift sniper rifle. Okay, I think that was my own footsteps. <laughs> there is something up here that I really want to try and get. Usually on the cream there is a Shadow Stalker. I don't really like them much. But um, they are very useful if you get a headshot with them. Shadow Stalker. Just to have it. Let's head back down. Alright, we're back down. The area clear, I think the area is pretty much clear. Um, I should probably get going. I will not be taking a vehicle, that's not necessary. I would think that they are already over there. Um, well, a player just died, so that's one player less to worry about. Is there any military magazines? Yes, there are. And another dot site. I will take it. 
I don't have a timber wolf, so I will just ignore that. Let's see if there should be anything interesting in the bank. Um, I'll take... Okay, I cannot equip a grip on this thing. That's fine. Um, nothing in here. That's good. Makes it easier for me. Okay, so the Olympia military base in, is in this direction. I just quickly want to make this into my makeshift sniper. Just in case. Um, since the scope is on it, or can go on it, I think it would be able to get on this gun as well, but I won't be doing that. Only problem is my clothing is camouflaged for desert. We aren't really in a desert, we're more like in a forest type area. Um, so I don't know how helpful that is, but um, we'll see what we can do here. Maybe I shouldn't have chosen the desert skin for this gun. Okay, now I want to take it a little bit slow. See if anyone is around sniping or something like that. Um, I don't see anyone at the moment. So I think I might be the first one here. But if anyone is coming, they would be coming um, from behind me. So I actually do want to get a move on and get in there if possible. And maybe take position in one of these towers. Oh, I cannot jump over that. Well, that's annoying. Come on, please be a opening somewhere. No, I can't jump over them. I think I have to go in from the front. Oh no. Does one no just don't want anyone sneaking up from behind me. Oh nope. That's just the screen doing weird stuff with these things. Yeah, I don't think anyone has been here. Which is good. And I get an advantage. Maybe. Maybe. I want to take position in this tower, I think. Just want to quickly check if there should be any military ammo. There is. Just take it and head on up to the tower. I'll leave I'll lay down and use third person to see if anyone's coming. Oh, I see a car coming. It stopped. Where are they? There, I see them. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> That's something very annoying when I play this game because the sound is so loud. Um, I jump when I get um, when I get shot like that. Okay. Ow. Hey, not nice. I'm actually pinned down because this isn't a like sniper rifle. Where did it go? Right over there. I don't even know if this has the range to get him. He's moving by the trees. Oh, I got a headshot. I hit him again. Come on, we almost have him. We almost have him. Ow. I think he has a maple strike as well, by the sound of it. Whoa, four percent. Oh man. Now I'm happy I picked up all those dressings. <laughs> okay. Where's he moving? He's not dead yet. His mythicals makes it easy for me to find him. Um, I don't want him to come up from behind either. Which I think is his plan. I 
I think while I healed, he might be whoa. He may have moved. Whoa! What was that? That was a grenade. <laughs> Sorry, I need to lower my volume. I think <laughs> the problem is then I can't hear people moving around. I think he might be trying to divert my attention. Whoa! Where is that coming from? Whoa! Whoa! Where's he at? Change it to semi. I can't see him. Oh, there. Whoa. I almost had him. His problem is I, he has to move around. Need to move to the gate in order to get in. What he is doing. Yes, finally. I got him. Whew. That was an intense fight. Now, one guy remaining. Where is he? <laughs> I'm ready for you. Probably not. I will probably end getting sniped or something with a grizzly. I'm tempted to go loot his body, but I don't think he has anything... Well, I know he has medical supplies most likely, but other than that, it's too risky. Come on, where are you? Well, I need to move over there. I'll move to the next tower and see if I can get a clear view to get him. Hopefully so. And he should be coming from the water or something. He's not coming from this direction, definitely. Then I would have seen him. So he must must be up in the mountains or down at the trees. Unless he's like far behind and healing on the way. That might be a possibility. Um I don't see anyone. Oh it's over there now. I gotta move. <sighs> This is it. This is where I might die. Oh, I see him. He's in the water. I see him in the water. I got him. I won. Yes. Well, GG. Well played all. <laughs> I won. GG, everyone. Phew, that was an intense game and I got eliminated by the arena. Just great. Alright, so let's do... I think there's a kid called Grizzly. Yes, and do max skills. And let's just take one more match here and see what we can do. Just hold on a second. Uh, yes. So I took the kid Grizzly. Um, it's my favorite sniper rifle because you can just keep hitting the fire button without having to like pick the next bullet and stuff like that. Um, I don't actually know what it's called. It's not reloading because you don't reload the entire clip. I'm pretty sure someone spawned over there. They're, they usually do. Mm. Though I can't seem to f find anyone. Um, yeah, I'll take the mid kit. Just see, yeah. Uh, take the dot sight. I do need like a like that peacemaker, an automatic weapon for my secondary. So I'll take this. Thank you very much. And I'll equip the that and that and disable that. And where's the circle closing in on? We need to get a move on to here. 
and make a stop at Scorpion 7, I think. So I think actually I will be taking the vehicle and drive up through Everett and then up to Scorpion 7. If I can get out of this gas station. Yes, right through here, up to the road and up to Scorpion 7. Let's go. All right, Scorpion 7 is right around the corner, right there. So I'll get out here. There's a car there with a person. That I just killed. Wow, did it, didn't it have bullet drop or something? I don't think so. Anyways, we got a kill. Um, I think the area is clear. I think I'm actually going to stay up here. Um, although I should probably move on over to here. But I think this might be a stop for many people. That counts this way. Hmm. You know what, I'll slowly move around and then over to that place, but I'll keep an eye out on Scorpion 7, just in case. I am wearing a ghillie suit, so it should be hard for people to see me moving up here. Oh, here's the map border. Great. Okay, it's definitely easy f for them to see me on this rock. <laughs> uh, a moving bush. I wonder if it's a moving bush or if it's a man covered in a bush. Yeah, I think it would be pretty obvious. Um, since bushes can really move. I could also camp at Scorpion 7, but I don't think I will. So let's just get over here and see what we can do. I don't think anyone else is there. I could go loot that guy, but I don't think I will. So I'll just head on over to Scorpion 7 and we'll see what happens. All right, quick update. We are taking a look at the bridge here. So before we go down there, check the area. I think it's clear. And we'll just cross this area and up on that hill. And then we should be there actually. I just want to see if there should be any loot or something here. Maybe. Um, there's a Viper, there's that. I'll take a dressing. We saw in the last match that you can't really have too much of it. Uh, I'm stuck there. Yeah, nothing too, nothing too interesting. Let's just keep going. Whoa. Okay. That came from up here. Right around here, at those trees. Should probably be even more sneaky than just walking. It came right here. Or somewhere close in a way. Maybe down at the waterfront. Or the beach. I should say. <laughs> uh, oh, I see a car and I see a guy. I got him. I got one in a way. Whoa. Where did that come from? Right there, right there. I got him. I got him. Okay, one people remaining, or one guy remaining. <laughs> um, I should take position right outside at a place where no one really will be coming from, like this tree. And I should hide and see if anyone is coming. They could come from the opposite of the water. Well, we came second place at the very least. Very happy about that. <laughs> um, I'm just a bit annoyed that I don't have any more weapons for this peacemaker because I might need it. Let's just take a look at the map here. 
Yeah, he's, if he's over here, he still has a way to go. So it might be a while before he gets here. Especially if he's crossing the water. Um. Also, I have to be careful if he's a sniper, he might be able to see me from the other side. This is actually a pretty bad spot, <laughs> to be honest. Because I can't see behind that hill. Let's try and move up a bit. Yeah, I think this is a better hiding spot because then we can see if anyone comes from here. Um, I don't see. Oh, right there, right there. Takes a shot. Yes. GG. Well played, all. Again. All right, so we won two rounds. GG, I'm very happy about that. Um, I think I'm getting better at it anyways. Um, I'll just quickly exit so I don't get into the next match as well. So yeah, two victories in a row, not that bad. So with that said, I hope you enjoyed this episode and if you did, remember to leave a like, comment and share it with your friends. And if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.